uh, time now for my particular favourite, Buzzers of Death. Yeah! Oh, yeah! And the power! Yeah! Don't you mongrel! Stop it! H.G. Nelson and Amanda Keller will face off over a series of multiple choice questions. But you must wait! <laughs> till I finish the question before you answer. Don't! <laughs> now that is scary. <laughs> so I think we've checked Dr. Nelson's buzzer. Want me to check mine? Can I, can I, can I, can I? Yeah, go on. Hey. Oh. Oh. Hey. Oh. I'm just... I'm just waiting. I'm just so filled with fear. First question, train spotting in South London. In South London, whoa, it's just, it's scaring me. In South London, railway workers found the body of a man next to the tracks. What happened? A, he was trying to race the train like Superman and ran headfirst into a bridge. <laughs> B, he tried to jump off before buying a ticket and was hit by a train going the other way. Or C, he relieved oh. himself onto a live railway line. Yeah. 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 Amanda! Well, it obviously didn't happen in New South Wales because we don't have any trains and he might have passed away from old age while waiting for one. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Feel it! In your face, Premier, whose name I don't know. <laughs> in your face, whoever you are. Um, well, having pressed the buzzer, I'm not sure what the answer is. So, is there anything you'd like to say? <laughs> well, can I press my buzzer then? Can I press it? No, 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 no. Oh! I think he pissed on the railway oh, tracks. Bye. Thank you very much. I'm going to give it to HG. Oh, oh, next question: <laughs> Buying the farm in India, a woman cutting grass for her cattle was attacked from behind by a stalker. What did she do? A Flipped him over a shoulder, right into the thresher. B. Shook him off, then ran him down in a ride on mower. Or C. Cut off his head with her sickle and walked through the market holding it aloft. Oh! Oh! Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. I reckon the ride on mower. It doesn't matter. I just thought that's the most unlikely, right. stupid thing yes. after yes. something had happened romantically to drive over somebody with a ride on mower. I use romantically advisedly there, though, Paul. Ah, I, I do understand that, actually. Anyone else want to crack uh, it? On the ride on mower, was she the victor? Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, hey. Anyone else want to crack it? Maybe A. You're going A. You're going A. Maybe oh, I reckon it's C. Anybody? Anybody? C. 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 Oh! C, the audience get it this time. No one else gets any points. Congratulate yourself. Go on. Good on you. Hey, Paul. I never get to do this. Oh. Uh, final question. Heaven on a stick. In the UK, a restaurant worker passed away in the kitchen. Mm. What did his boss do? A. Put him in the big freezer under the ice cream. <laughs> B. Stepped over the body and kept making kebabs. <laughs> or C. Moved him out of the kitchen to distract the rats. <laughs> oh! Oh! I'd like to think they put him in the freezer. Oh, but really, I think he probably stepped over him and kept making kebabs. Yes. Yes. Out yes. of the bloke. No. Me. Let's see. Yes! Me! Me! The salmonella must go on. Yes, in Wolverhampton, catering boss Jess Windersing kept making kebabs while a worker lay dead in the same room. Yeah. Now that's how interesting making kebabs is. <laughs> in this situation, the worker's body is technically known as the kebabber's cadaver. <laughs> <laughs> Happily, police confirmed there were no suspicious circumstances and the pit of bread was just there to keep the body warm. <laughs> them now, 75 points, them 73 points. <laughs> and because it is the last show of the year, I'm coming out the front for this one. You can, you can, you can thrill and be amazed as I cross the wires. Actually, our poorly boy. Live in front of you, ladies My and gentlemen. Crossing the wires. Hang on, hang on, no, 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 no. Now, let's make it real fun. A little bucket of water there. Step in that, young fella. 
Electricity and water, that's not a good combination, is it? Always a winner. <laughs> okay, okay. In your pocket. Yes or no? Oh, that's not comfortable. Okay, mate. All right, let's no, go for it. No, 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 no. Let's let's dress you properly. Gary, Gary, one time I buy. Now, where have I seen this look before? <laughs> I think I think I saw it on the internet. <laughs> okay, are we ready to cross the wires? Here we go. Have I got them anywhere near each other? Yep. Ah. Ah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>